In this Python Streamlit tutorial, we will make a web application with multi pages. There will be three pages for Python, JavaScript, and Java on the web page. I will show you how to apply the application step by step in the video. To support us, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video. First, I will activate the web server. I open terminal. I open command input. I activate the activate file so that the codes I write run in the virtual environment. You can activate the web server by typing this code. I activated the web server. Now I add a side by object to the web page. I added the side by object to the web page. I add a folder named pages to the project. I add a code file named Python tutorial to the pages folder. The code file I add to the folder is instantly added to the sidebar object. I add a code file called JavaScript tutorial to the folder. A second page file was added to the sidebar object. Finally, I add a code file named Java tutorial to the folder. I added pages for Java, JavaScript, and Python to the web page. I add a header to the main code file. I added the header to the web page. Now let's code the code file I created for the pages. I will use these images on the website. To access the images, you can go to the GitHub page in the description section of the video. I import the Streamlit library in the Python tutorial file. I add the Python image to the web page and adjust its size. I added the relevant image to the Python page. I am adding a simple text to the web page. I added the text for Python to the web page. I will do the same process in the JavaScript page. I am importing the Streamlit library. I am adding the image to the JavaScript web page. I am adding text to a web page. JavaScript and Python pages work as I want. Finally, I edit the web page I created for Java. I'm copying and pasting. I am adding a text for Java. I can test the application. The application works as I want. In this video, we created a streamlit web application with multi-page. To support us, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video.